Hello. Today, I will be demonstrating how to install a temporary license, otherwise referred to as a demo or evaluation license, of one of the software options on the PNA family of Keysight Vector Network Analyzers. If you obtain a demo license for a software option on the PNA family of network analyzers from your local Keysight representative, then you most likely received an email that contained a line in it that looked something like this. The first thing I like to do when I receive an email from my Keysight representative is to copy this line of information into a text file on the PNA so that it is there for quick and easy reference. Examining this line, we can see a few pieces of important information listed. The first thing we see is the option number that we will be activating the measurement fee functionality for. In this case, option 86. We can see the model number of the PNA that we requested this for, as well as the serial number. Then we can see the key code for the option to enable it. As well as, since we have a temporary license, we can see the expiration date for the option. Now verify that the model number and serial number in the license file match that of the PNA. You can find the model number and serial number as well as a great deal of other information using the Help About Network Analyzer menu item that I show here. We can see that both the model number, serial number, as well as the options currently activated on this analyzer are all displayed in this dialog. So now, let's go ahead and check that, yep, we are going to be activating option E6. The model number lines up, and so does the serial number for this analyzer. Let's go ahead and add option 086 gain compression measurements onto this analyzer. So we go to the utility menu, the system, then configure, and then the option enable menu item that closes down the PNA application and starts the option enable application. The first thing to do in this application is to select the option we will be activating on the analyzer. Again, in this instance, the option 086 gain compression measurements from the pull-down menu, so we scroll through to find it. Now what we can do is since we copied the license information onto this PNA and text file, we can quickly copy and paste the license keyword into the Option Enable Dialog's keyword entry area. And then since I have a temporary evaluation license for this option, the next thing I have to do is go to the lower left-hand corner of the dialog and select the option type to be temporary. So now let's enter the expiration date exactly as it's shown in the license file. If I had ordered a permanent upgrade to my analyzer, instead of checking the temporary radio button and selecting the entry date, I could have just toggled that to permanent and left it be and clicked the enable button. But instead, I have a temporary license. So I'll leave this selected as temporary, click the enable button, wait a few moments, and we can now see that option 086 has been installed onto this analyzer. We exit the option enable application. The PNA application automatically restarts. And we can check that option 86 is indeed enabled on this analyzer by going to the Help About Network Analyzer dialog again. Scrolling through the list of installed options, seeing that indeed option 86 gain compression measurements has been activated and is showing in the list. And we can now make gain compression measurements with the gain compression measurement class. Using this information, as well as the information found on the PNA support website shown here, you can see what options and upgrades are available as license key upgrades on any given PNA series family of network analyzers. Thank you very much. Have fun.
and happy measurements.